What's going on guys, it's your boy Jack aka The Balden Reef are coming at you today's video which is another instalment for the prep for the Autumn Koi Show where we are doing the Karashigoi Challenge as well as the 10 Fish Challenge and also some massive, massive discounts on some Tosoi, uh, Nisoi and Sansoi fish as well. Uh, we've got Danny, we've got Ian Scrapers, make sure everything's whistle clean which it still is. We've got Coyle here as well, hey. he's trying to duck away from the camera. There's a lot of hands to the pump today, getting everything prepped uh, for the weekend. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. Barbecue, pumpkins, hay bales, proper autumn theme. It's going to be incredible. But because we're pulling some fish out, we kind of thought, well, let's put some fish in a bowl and show people some of the quality of the fish that are going to be on offer on the weekend and also what kind of pricing they're going to be going for. Now, these are on a first come, first serve basis. If there's anything you like the look of, hit me up in the comments section down below. Just as a little bit of an FYI as well, the website is going to be temporarily closing very, very soon. The reason for that is, as you are all aware, and as I am massively aware, our customer services has taken a massive hit because there's just too many things going on at the farm this winter. We are building a full picking and packing house at the farm uh, where all of the orders will be sorted and done with. So that is why we are only going to be running the sale that we've been discussed because I know a lot of people have been messaging me about it in person on the weekend. Now, on the weekend, if you cannot make it down and you're after something, pick up the phone and give me a call. And if it's there, you can put it to one side and you can collect at a later date. No payment will be needed. Do not worry. But enough about that because that's going to have its own deeper dive video done soon. But let me show you some of the fish that we've got because boy oh boy it's gonna be a good old day let's go okay so one of the first vats that we're looking at is for key um key at series as you can see from the reticulation of the patterns they look absolutely fantastic i was seriously seriously debating keeping hold of these four until after winter to develop them out because the sumi is really really starting to come through now these i would say are in the region of around this one 25 to 30 uh 30 to 35 30 to 35 and again 30 to 35. because of how rare the uh kiatsuris are to actually get hold of uh these four we're going to be letting go for 150 each and like i say this is a fantastic development fish that you guys are going to be able to see change over the winter coming into spring and really really hone out and develop that sumi that's actually in the body of these but these guys are absolutely impeccable like i say hand selected development fish these are by no means finished what you don't want to do is look at a fish in the atsuri range high atsuri uh ki atsuri shiro atsuri that's finished at this size because it's going to stay that way you want this sumi to really start to come in and develop out so the bigger your fish grows the sumi and the, and the coloration is going to stay and grow with the fish you're not going to be losing it in essence you're actually going to be gaining the sumi on these but for fantastic specimens there let's get on to the next bowl let's go okay so looking at the next bowl Sancho Kajaku, and we've got various different strains of Kajakus in here, some pure Kajakus, as you can see here, and then a, uh, two uh, Kajaku crosses. Uh, but again, fish in this bowl, ranging from sort of 90 pounds for the very big female cross, same as this one. Um, 120 on these two, 110 on the Showa, which is similar to the Kanako Showa. 110 and again 120 on the big one so like i say there's some massive massive fish coming home extreme quality all deals to be done on the day folks all deals to be done on the day red all farm the address is in the video description down below looking at these guys in here just putting a lighter benny kikakuru on there again you can start to see where the zip starting to come through again the sorogoi achiba the reticulation, the scales are just starting to come through now, which is really, really good. Uh, and the same on this one as well. This is more of a more of a development one. Development one. You can see where 
like I say, the lighter grey patches are starting to come in. Um, but again, a little bit more of a gamble fish, but literally a big fish to gamble on. £50 only, that one is. This bad boy down here, you're going to run your back at around 125 on that fish. Danny's just putting another really, really good Benny Kikakuru. Uh, sitting around the 130 range. Like I say, big, big, big end of season sale. It's going to be absolutely incredible. The next bowl over. We've got a nice Ayo Garomo. Uh, Yoshiki Roy have done fantastically well on the show scenes this year with the Ayo Garomo and the Shasuis as well. We have got a red Achiba in there as well. Let me come away from the light so you can see a bit better. There you go. So we have got the red Achiba. And you can tell it's the red Achiba because this isn't white, it's more of a bluey grey telltale sign. Hannah Shisui, a little bit of the uh, the blue coming through, full zip on this Shisui here. Anything that's in this bowl, very, very nice Showa coming through. Uh, price anything from £40 to the most expensive one being this Showa here for £90. It's going to be incredible. Let's go! Okay, just looking at another very big mixed bowl. Um, again, looking at something Nissai, probably 45 to 50 cm. Uh, this is going to be 160 for the sheer size of it. You can see the Sumi is inky, inky black. The same on its twin little sister next to it. Uh, again, this is going to be in the region of 100 pounds. Uh, this one's going to be in the region of 90 pounds. Again, if you look at the two Kohakus that are in the bowl, 70 pounds on the smaller one uh, and 85 pounds on the slightly bigger one. Coming over to the next bowl over. Again, Goshki, uh, Benny Goy, nice big male um, Kikakuru there as well. Dan's just putting another small Aogoromo in there too. And again, there's a very small Showa in there too. Coming over to the next bowl, uh, looking at a very big Benny Kikakuru. You can see when we're explaining on other videos, when the Sumi really starts to clean out and you're left with that really, really nice, vivid, luscious Benny uh, on the sides. Again, another big Haku, tiny split fin on this one, uh, but again, the reason why it's priced at 120 pounds, Nissai, both of these in the range of 45 to 50 cm, and then looking at some of the uh, olive chags that we've got available as well, with that half moon boat handle line in them. Um, again, this bad boy's gonna be priced at 80 pounds. A lot of fish, folks. There is a lot of fish. Like I say, just a very short, sweet, sharp video. Just to show you some of the fish that are going to be on offer, Red Hall Farm address is in the video description down below. We are going to have some dry goods available. <coughs> we are going to have pumpkins, soft drinks, barbecue. It's going to be incredible. There's going to be a lot of different shorts coming out over YouTube over the next sort of seven, uh, 72 hours uh, or so. Um, bought everything straight and clean, which is really, really good. Um, it's exactly what we want. I mean, to be fair, I haven't even shown you half of these are going to be available and yes that is a tension um so a lot a lot a lot of fish but i need to go pick april up from work now um you know the drill follow me on facebook and twitter which is at the balding reefer instagram is slightly different which is at the dot balding dot reefer but other than that stay safe stay sane most importantly people stay happy balding reefer out